Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to Let's Play King's Bounty 2. Last time we um, basically changed into a mage. So um, we got rid of the um, thing that reduces our uh, movement speed, so the boots. So now we move quickly again. Yay. We have this thing which gives um, one to the power here. So the Gordian's ring at some point. kind of want to change it. I mean, minus 300 leadership might not be the best way to go. If I would have changed anything. Would take off one disciple only. Actually. Wait a second. I had not noticed, but this is the max. So, that's interesting. So... The crossbowmen and the swordsmen are quite efficient in terms of leadership, but this one isn't. So the max uh, troop size is 8 of these dogs. I did not know. I thought we could go up to 10. Wouldn't that be better to use the um, spirits of light here? This is way more efficient in terms of, um, well, yeah, we have this guy at five, so we have something at high initiative now, or at least higher initiative. So it makes sense to use these, and this is an order guy, so sure, let's go. Let's level him up. Yeah. As I was saying, um, how much leadership is that guy at? 2,300. So, you know what? I think swapping that ring out. Oh, no, we lose 350. Right, this one has 50. I mean, the 15 resistance is uh, appealing. Eight knowledge, O1 order morale. Ten health too. I have a feeling that this is better. Because to be honest, morale, sure you get an extra turn. It's RNG, right? This is twelve extra health, two percent extra, right there. This one isn't good enough. So this one... <laughs> so we have resistance. Oh, okay, so this, this ring actually gives, gives resistance, not uh, armor. Of course, armor, we could have considered it, maybe. But I think this might be better than the one uh, morale here. Slightly. Well, we are t hitting four guys with it, though. Eight knowledge, ten health. No, nah, maybe it is better than. Yeah. Decisions, decisions. Let's use this. Uh, we have one talent point which we don't want to use. Cost ten k to reset talent. So, yeah, first one was was a freebie. Next one won't be. So, better mo don't make mistakes now. Anyway, um. This is all quest. We've visited all the vendors. Uh, let's visit uh, the quest givers here and then uh, move down here. Well then, Rosens. Let's... Well, Rosens, you lost the bet. You may commence taking notes for me. There's a certain formula for replacing lost limbs that requires a staggering amount of research. Listen, Syl. My magical senses have served me well many times. Give me another chance. You give me something serious, then you'll win. Something that I can see plain proof of. <sighs> okay. You're going to receive a score of average in alchemy, Silveros. What? I just sensed our favorite graybeard in the laboratory. He was marking your grade on the sheet with a ridiculously long quill. Average for me? That's a lie. And a laughable one at that. Your special sense is good for nothing. 
I felt it, Silveros. It is right. You will soon see I am a real mage. And a seer. Damn Ulagi possessed me just now. I sensed nothing at all about our alchemy teacher. How am I going to get out of this? Silveros and I are friends, sure, but to slave away in the library in his place? I won't get a wink of sleep this year. I see you standing there, listening. Are you interested in magic? Do you suppose you can surprise me? Listen then, I have an artifact, a magical quill which can reproduce any handwriting. You use the nib to write and the feather to erase. Well, well, that sounds useful. Try it yourself. Take this quill, go to the laboratory and write average next to the name Silveros on Sequester's grade sheet. It is crucial that you picture yourself writing in Sequester's hand. You have my word. It will be exactly the same. Even the mentors won't spot it. Interesting. Don't you reckon this method might be a little too blunt? Sequester will suspect me right away, but he wouldn't think of you. The quill is hidden in the yard, under the bench. Right. I have a feeling that... We're gonna get an option here to uh, hand it in. <laughs> Probably will. So we got the quill of forgery. So. Oh. Should also fizz do this soon. But let's uh, get over here first. Is that an elf? No, look a little bit like it. Yeah, we haven't seen any elves. We have seen some dwarves. We can even could even recruit some dwarves, but we haven't seen any um, elves yet. So, huh. we will get to that at some point. I see a thing to pick up. So. Has everyone look. read Over there. Treatise on the nature of things? Is of only elements and. I'm reading books. Not listening to you. Okay, we'll talk. Repeat. Ag yeah. Agnus. Aha, uh -huh. I've been expecting you. You're going to help me. See these ignorant disciples? They've littered the school's ether with their mispronounced logoi. You need to cleanse the ether and set a good example for them. Can you see the three misshapen logoi? Uh, not really. Right. I forgot you never had a proper education. Just wait a moment. Are you going to cast a spell on me? Hic sentio logi. Now you can see them. What are you waiting for? Set a good example for my pupils. All you need to do is extinguish the logoi in the right order. If they start multiplying, you've made an error. Begin with the farthest one. Well, start already. Start with the furthest one. I see three. Yeah, uh, two. It's boring too. I'm doing pretty well so far. Are they different? Look the same to me. I'm sure I can think of something else. Is it me or do they look exactly the same? Go this way. I'm doing pretty well so far. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> this one? It worked. Alright. 
Meanwhile, I'm gonna take uh, all the mana I have here. Thank you. What's that? Ooh, 150. That's a lot. Okay, we're gonna return them all. So what do you need? I am seeking a mage named Palatinus. You two paid him a visit the night before the disaster, did you not? Oh no. Ursula. Calm your britches, Albert. I will tell them everything. Palatinus is a famous alchemist. A genius, in fact. We ordered a rejuvenating potion from him for Albert's mother and paid a good price for it. But when we came to collect the potion, Paladinus had fled, leaving us empty-handed. That was about the same time the panic started. The hubbub, the shouting. We only escaped by the seams of our stockings. If you're still here, Palatinus must still be nearby. Any ideas where he might be hiding? He was seen in the vicinity of the tower several times. It is rumored he's completely lost his mind, overwhelmed by illusions and arcane fixations. I must admit, we've given up any hope of getting our money back. Palatinus is both insane and dangerous. It would be better if someone else found the wizard and took care of him without our help. Someone who would be a match for him. What does that mean, dear heart? Yes. It means we we'll get after supper yesterday. Roast beef? Anything here we can pick polar up? Bear. A live polar bear. It really was a polar bear. Honest. It was the size of a cat, though. And then it slowly vanished. Hmm. Just here. Or nothing else here. Okay, let's do this quest too. We're gonna, of course, hand it in because we want order rep. Yay! Oh no, I'm just doing a little check here. Just scroll over here somewhere. We'll uh, get there. Oh, that's Silver Ross. These scrolls are well hidden. There we go. Trophies of War. That sounds like land magic. I implore you. No, I demand of you. Capture that storm. Okay. Lady Gisella, please be patient. I already sent several disciples to resolve this issue. If I started selling my patients at five coppers a cup, I'd be richer than the king. Well, I have this. Hmm, how may I be of assistance? One of your students is plotting to falsify someone's grade. Right there in your grade sheet. Uh, could you be more specific, please? His name is Rosens. Here's the magic quill he intended to use. Outrageous! These are future alchemists. The purity of their minds has a direct influence on the mixtures. I cannot let this pass without consequences. Give me the quill. All right. What a points. Wait, did I get something out of that? Three percent health. Is that a necklace or a ring? It's a ring. No, it is a necklace. Okay. Wait. I know you. I recognize you from the Universal Assembly. Anyone would remember your face. Well, I can't say the same for you. I am Baroness Gazella Wilmore Durden. What luck running into you. Ah oh, yes, I used to know your father. I once granted him permission to do business in Ambos. But that's not why you're so glad to see me, is it? 
I wanted to visit my ancestral home, Castle Arden, relive childhood memories, maybe even repair the structure. But an enraged rogue spirit has taken root there. And while these mages are refusing to help me, the creature is wrecking my family's castle. My lady, your words wound me. My disciples are doing their utmost to help you, even as we speak. But Archmage Kaythorn claims you'd need an army to capture this, as he calls it, Air Elemental. According to the Archmage, the Elemental escaped from the Mage Factory. Since he also claims the Mage Factory is suffering the plague, I and everyone else in Nostria would appreciate it if you assisted these students of the much-esteemed sequester in capturing that darned spirit. A spirit from the Mage Factory, you say? I should probably check this out. Yes, we'll do. First though, reading scrolls. <laughs> I mean, selecting them, hoping I'm getting a quest out. I'm not actually reading. Oh. Is it a quest too, on the nature of things? I implore you. Capture that darn spirit. I like that we're, <laughs> that we're, that, that we've been tracking like this, uh, this, this thing for ages and it doesn't even give us anything. What's our main quest? Oh, we have to defeat those guards. Oh, okay. So we have like three more quests. Pelotinus. Right. It's interesting that there's no like um, but it isn't like um, a linear quest. Got a resolve. Is there? Yeah. There we go. That's for later. Because we're still uh, exploring here. That's the south gate. Uh, we kind of kind of want to explore this part first. Been there, good. Were you the one who riled up the elementals? Yes, I think. Something to be found here. Is that the arch archmages? Nice. Mm. Let's go here first. The tower thing is the main, main, uh, main event the here. We'll get there later. Is the most important. Yeah, Maximus was part six. Nice. Do we need to talk to this guy? Yes. A man named Xandor borrowed some scrolls and books from the library. Is that so? Well, of course I know Xander. He's the most irresponsible royal mage to ever live. Hard to forget a man like that. A scoundrel took three of my books to check for references. And I've neither seen nor heard from him since. It's been more than a week. He's scampering all over the country with my priceless tomes in tow. I keep tracking his movements, but he always manages to slip away. Did you leave the mark of the all-seeing eye on him? Not Xander precisely, but the books. Have you not heard of library markings? Ta, never mind. You'll see everything in a moment. Ecce liberos. Can you feel them now? All right. So we need to find tombs. Tomes. Okay. So do we know where they are? Oh, Rosens is here now. <laughs> He's probably mad. Oh. 
That's far away. I think if we level up once more, we probably should go for... Um, for the, uh, Can't you go the around? castle siege thing, which we filled earlier. Can I steal this chest? No, it looks like morbid though. Well, not much else here. Let's hand this, in, uh, this quest back in here. Rector's birthday is the most important event. Hey, chest. Let's go. Doesn't feel that bad to miss a chest because it's mostly rubbish and some mana and gold in there. I haven't. I've, I've, there's only been a few where there were actually I, actual items in there. So yeah, pretty good. Much better than that. Uh, I don't feel that bad if I miss one. His research. I never doubted for a second you'd be able to solve our little problem. I'm used to more challenging assignments. For a non-graduate of the Mage's Tower, you did a great job. Better than some of the dunderheads standing before me now. Alright. Thank you, Meteor. Hold on a second. That sounds good. Pretty good. It's AOE. 140 to 100 to 140. It's uh, after leveling up, there's gonna be more than this, so definitely want that. Yeah, well, now it's already doing more damage. Well, I can knowledge 150. What am I doing with. Uh, mm, oh, this is AOE as well. Uh, that's fear, fracture, curse, morale reduction. Yeah, what did the check stone skin? I need 140 for it. So I'm really close to getting uh, stone skin up now. Hmm. This stamp thing though. Mainly because I am going the mage route, but I really want to get this ASAP. So 140. So I need 19 more. It's uh, actually kind of close. Okay, let's head south. Let's head down there. Were you the one who riled up the elemental? Yes, that was I. <laughs> Okay, let's go to the tower. Or at least, I'm not sure if I can get to the tower. No, there's an invisible wall in front of the tower. Is there an invisible wall here too? For an with Major oh, for over an hour. not really. And so, in that case, I wanna. Hey, this uh, Iron Golem is also alive. The other one's squirrel. Uh, Immobilized. There's a chest back here. I'm gonna map up, see if I missed anything. Doesn't look like it. Oh, there's a scroll. Dispel. That's something we need to learn as well, right? Don't think it, we've learned it. It's probably live. Yeah, we're gonna dispel that. So this dispels friendlies, and I guess uh, the level three dispels negative effects from me and uh, positives from enemies instead of everything, because that's what it's I've doing. I've been waiting for an audience with Major Erasmus for over an hour, and I'm just walking right past. Come back. Come along. I could just talk to him. This other guy's waiting for an hour. It's a girl, sorry. We don't need to though, we need to get up here. All disciples one we need to talk to. Wait, it doesn't get us in. Let's go. 
Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Sorry, I got distracted. Are you interested in astronomy? Yes. I monitor the glow and color of the stars, for such is my discipline. I can see you've come from afar. The road that lies ahead of you is also long. Longer than the road here? I doubt it. I have a map to a dungeon. It is full of magic artifacts and ancient treasures. I had once thought of going there myself. But I see now that this will never happen. Magic artifacts, you say? Is this map for sale? Of course. It's yours for a mere handful of gold coins. It's not so far-fetched to think an ancient mage's cave might be hidden in some obscure corner of Nostria. Here's the scroll. It's yours for 500 coins 500? anytime. Well worth it. Oh, and he's out. Buy it. Okay, gotcha. How wonderful. You're rich. For now, I'm a handful of coins poorer. Thank you, though. That map is more than just a dusty old bit of vellum with an X on it. It is a dream. May it come true in your hands. Thank you. Directions to the dungeon. Is it going to be a trap? <laughs> so this actually does show where the books are, which is nice. There's an ancient dungeon here. Yeah, we're not going to track this. Let's track something more useful. <laughs> it's not really anything <laughs> very, not much very useful here, right? Okay, um, yeah, I want to go over here. Nice. That's uh, we finally gotta mount up, though. So I've worry. been waiting for an audience with Major Asmus for over an hour. Waiting on someone else is quite contrary to my noble nature. Yet I am forced Let's to go. follow my pride. This time. Is this, a uh, this is also a slow place, slow walk place. Um, well, we have to go the way all the way up here or there and fast travel there, but then we get a loading screen, so let's go north. I think this is just as fast. At least it won't. We'll be close. <laughs> so, yeah, I kind of want a bit more leadership still, I think. Because these sentries we found uh, one of these guys selling might actually be pretty good for this. Oh, there's a... Oh, yeah, we know that. We have that stone. Good. There we go. Let's go. Lord to the south. Maybe do a fight, right? Don't think we... Yeah, we haven't fought a single thing this whole episode. <laughs> there's a race. There's a scroll here. Topper. Hello. Nothing of note here. Yeah, we're probably gonna fight next episode. <laughs> There's a barrel here we missed. I think this is a place to end then. Didn't do much. Just uh, running around. Uh, much most people running around the uh, mage. What is it? Tower? Mage city? Hey, there's a scroll here. Huh, we'll get there later. So, yeah. I want to thank everyone for watching. Can't save anymore. Need to just manual save something. Let's manual save up there. There we go. Thank you. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye bye.